junkfoodtaster.com and today we do some cotton candy experiments. So experiment number one is just to drop the cotton candy into water. So here we go, here's the cotton candy in two parts. And let's do it, one, two, three. Magic, it just vanished and nothing there. Some sugar. And we continue with experiment number two. All right, so experiment two is step by step. So basically we see. <laughs> All right. Um, it smells interesting. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> All right. Experiment number three. Here we go. It's Fanta. And let's drop in more cotton candy. This time I'm taking the green one. And I've got a towel. So I hope nothing happens. One, two, three. All right. So. Very interesting. <laughs> Turned into green slime. Mmm, tastes mm, this tastes good. Okay. So we go for uh, it's the sieve. There we go. And I'm dropping some water over it. On your mind, it just vanishes into nothing, and we got um, this stuff is left uh -huh. red sugar. <laughs> Okay, um, maybe some fun in the next experiment. Okay, so you have all seen the 1000 degree knife videos. I show you now the water knife video. Only on my channel. Let's see what happens. Delicious. Oh, okay. yeah. <laughs> I can't resist. Okay. Exponent number six is um, something interesting, I think. So this time I giving the cotton candy a real chance by compressing it before I throw it. So my hands are super dry. And I try to compress it as, as much as I can. Unfortunately, it sort of falls apart. Ah, no. Okay, now we also know what happens when you compress cotton candy. Anyways, I throw now this into there. <laughs> it, it makes a nicer green inside the bowl. Otherwise, um, <laughs> it also instantly disappears. So yeah, this was kind of interesting. This looks good. I like this. Okay. Okay, my friends. So now I'm out of experiments. Now we have a side shot. There we go. This is a glass of water. You can see it almost uh, from the bottom now. Um, here comes our cotton candy stuff and I just drop it from the top in there. One, two, three. And it's gone. All right. And 
again. The last test is just how less water do I need <laughs> to destroy all the cotton candy. All right, look at this pattern. This was left by the cotton candy drop into the glass. But anyways, it's time for our last test. But I wasted so much cotton candy today. Go away, cable. <laughs> so unprofessional. Uh, I wasted so much cotton candy. At least I should try some. I try a little bit Lelo one. I tried the, some of the others. Mmm. Mmm, banana. Oh, I really don't want to waste this. I want to eat it all. Um. Hmm. But anyway, um, the last test is, um, so I'm taking my super delicious banana cotton candy. Come to me. Um, mm, this is really nice. Um, um, and I put water in it, but not much. As less as possible. And now I try to uh, steal it. Okay. Let's just taste this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. As you can see, I turn, turned it into sugar. And all the dry parts are gone. Actually, I could have used less water. Okay. I made a syrup out of it. Okay. So, <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this uh, review. Now you know like some sort of the physics of cotton candy. At least this was sort of the idea. So if you can learn about the physics of hot knives, I think it's okay to learn about the physics of cotton candy. Um, yeah. Otherwise, nothing more to say. So since I've made the experiment, you don't have to repeat them. Maybe you do, I don't know. And so if I mix, um, if I mix, yellow and blue there should be green so at least it's a little bit educational in the end so here comes yellow yellow now some blue you got a nice green okay my friends that's it thanks for watching and see you soon